Okay, hi. Hey, everybody. I wanted to speak to our founding agents. Uh, it's the turn of the year. I know that uh, we have to get our communication cycles together. A couple of things I want to talk to you about today. First of all, uh, <clears throat> pay close attention to the interactivity in this video, and I want to share with you some of the tools that we have. I'm going to take you out to the uh, uh, virtual world briefly and understand that we're in a demo process of that virtual world still because I need to onboard more agents before we have the finalized platform, okay? And that's the whole concept of having the founders agents was so that we had enough agents so that we could go to the monthly, um, uh, the monthly subscriptions, but we needed a base of agents. So we're still working on that. I'm working on that regularly, but I want to make sure that you agents have uh, what you need and that we are working together on a, on a, on a base. So this uh, is going to be turned into a virtual um, video, and you'll see the Enfuse video, and in each video with Enfuse, and that's a tool we have for everybody, and I can create them for you, and I can also get them so you can create your own. Uh, when we have this Enfuse video, you'll see a button come up, and it'll be a white paper, uh, it'll be an email button, uh, all different, it, and a little phone so it can come up, and that's for Live Connect, that little phone if people dial their own number into it, they will live connect to you. Put your number in there and they'll live connect. So that's one of our tools. So I did want to start out on, on Monday, uh, February 3rd, uh, 4th, Monday, February 4th, day after Super Bowl. We will have our first mastermind meeting. I'll send you, I sent you links, so you should have those links. Those links are for the uh, virtual world, and I also sent you a link to... Um, become a finance agent so you can offer uh, companies capital, okay? So uh, let's step inside the, the virtual world first and, uh, and we'll go from there, okay? So um, let me share the screen and we'll go in here to a boardroom. Okay, so here we are, we're in a boardroom and up on this board, on this, uh, on this uh, board I had a, um, I had a PowerPoint that was talking about our uh, some of our processes, okay? Just so you get a feel for what we can do. Um, in each of the places I take you, we, we have uh, screens, we have development. So this was about Rainmaker U, uh, the only 3D virtual selling and training platform in the insurance industry. And basically I can run through a whole presentation here. I'm not gonna do it right now, but I wanted to share with you some of the, the reasons why we, as a, as a team, want to do these different things, okay? Um, so all of the tools are meant to help for prospecting, help for marketing, obviously build sales concepts, which people now in our industry are paying others to give them sales concepts, so they're moving from place to place, but you don't need to. We have so much to offer. We have an incredible amount uh, of library for sales concept, white papers, and everything, which I'm now compiling a good deal of that into a zip file so I can give you one big file, okay? You also need lifelong learning. You've got to become coachable training, and, and you've got to stay in that content, okay? <clears throat> so, and most important, and that's what we're going to talk about in our first mastermind meeting, is personal thought leadership branding how to become an authority, okay? The whole idea in our life insurance sale, I keep trying to tell life insurance agents, nobody wants to buy life insurance. It's been this way. I've been, I've been around the business for over 40 years, and prior to me, I was trained by guys that were in the business for 40 years when I first stepped in. That's about 80 years, okay, uh, of experience. Now, in that timeline, that 80 years of experience, nothing's changed public opinion-wise. People don't want life insurance, they don't want to talk about dying. It's an unseemly conversation. They don't like it. So the best way to sell a ton of life insurance is to cross-sell. That means that you get in with somebody about something else, something they want, something they're attracted to, something they feel like really helps them, and then you have the nice discussion as an advocate. I'm, I'm here to speak to you as an advocate. I'm speaking for your family. I'm speaking for your kids. I'm speaking for the people who won't speak up. This is why we have to have a discussion about what do you do financially? How do you protect your family in case you're not here to continue earning the money you're going to earn? But better, better yet, 
when you do live that life, why, why not have the ability to take out tax-free income instead of what you're doing now? So that's the kind of message that you need to have with people, but you can't have it directly. You have to have it after a relationship is built on a cross-sell basis, okay? So that's truly what we're trying to get everybody to understand. Okay, the 3D virtual world, we're in it now, so you get a feel. Okay, you can see what's going on, education and all this good stuff, right? Okay, messaging. Now, if you notice, I did this for you. I can pull up the screen and get it right close to you. Same kind of thing. Okay, I'm going to step back here away from the, uh, I'm going to step back. I'm going to stand up, step back and show you what it looks like around the rest of the boardroom. You see another screen? I can go to that screen. I can create video and whatever I want on that screen. Okay, you see that screen? I can have whatever I want over there. So I can go from PowerPoint presentation to a video in a snap of a finger. I can go back from the video into the PowerPoint. I can go from the PowerPoint to a Google uh, land, uh, you know, a Google page that, that says, hey, you know, somebody raised their hand, asked a question. Oh, you want to get that answer? We'll go right to Google right away, okay? So all those things can be done. If I step back here, you can see this is just a, one of our conference rooms, okay? This is just what a conference room looks like. Now, you can have this smaller conference room. You could have a meeting with, uh, with uh, potential prospects. You could have a meeting with clients. You could have an agency meeting where you're training your own agents, okay? Uh, some of you are in the tax preparation world. You can come in here and you can meet with a person and put up something and and go through all of this. This is uh, the perfect way to never need a brick and mortar office. This is the perfect way to meet with anybody, anywhere, at any time. That's pretty powerful, okay? So all of the, the access here is very simple. Um, I'll also show you the auditorium, and, and, and lastly, a classroom. I think those are the two big items for you uh, to give you a feel. Okay, here's the auditorium. We got the big screen and the full auditorium, and we just go right down. Now, I'm in a Zoom presentation, so my the world's moving slower, okay, uh, because it's a video and a video. If we were all together, which we will be on our mastermind meetings, if we're all together in the world together, at the same time, this thing is instantaneous, okay? Now, you'll notice that uh, on the lower right-hand corner is the um, – is, is the uh, basically the presentation. That's the big board. Now, if I look out over the audience, you see in my lower right-hand corner, that's for the presenter, okay, and who's ever presenting. Now, we're in a demo world, so it's hard to identify that. Everybody will end up with that there. But when we're in our own total world that's totally uh, locked up and, and created only for our organization, that will only be the presenter's board, okay? Nobody else will see that. So that's an auditorium. That's what the auditorium looks like. Um, we'll go out to a classroom. Classroom's pretty neat. If it's set up right now, I can configure it in numerous ways, but the classroom is set up with, de uh, with uh, computers on the desk. I think you'll see, okay, we're not. We're just set up for desks, so let's, uh, let's configure it for computers, okay? So you'll see there'll be a computer on every desk, and that's a real computer. Okay, let's, uh, I'm sorry, hit the wrong button. That's a real computer. So let me go over here and Ooh, sit there's down. There's no such thing as a perfect writer. This is why I use Grammarly to check my work. If I'm putting commas in the wrong places, that can shift my credibility and mobility. So, to as you can see, something's on the, on the board. Okay, something is, uh, a video is up already on the big board. But if I sit in this seat right here, I'm sitting in front of a computer. Now, this computer, I'll pull up the screen. This is a live computer, okay? It helps me become a better so, writer and not be so afraid to share. English is my second language, but I use Grammarly every time I type on my computer. Grammarly is like an event. All right, so we just got to freeze Grammarly, okay? Um, so here, you see, this is a computer in a computer. So we really have a, 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 an ongoing live computer in here. You can go anywhere. Right down here in the lower right-hand corner is where we just put in wherever we want to go. Uh, I just put in the, 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 uh, the, the address, and we go right there, okay? So this can be used uh, in all presentations. It can be used with people in the classroom. You can have people on the same place in the same item on a computer right in front of them. 
Okay, so let me stand up and show you the classroom, uh, give you a little feel for what the classroom looks like. Uh, we look all around, his desks uh, can be configured many different ways. Okay, a lot of areas for signage, okay. Uh, lastly, let me take you out to a, um, let me, let's go to uh, the office. Let's go to the office. Now there's a little office area. So here you can have one-on-ones. Uh, again, uh, there's screens, there's screen activities. You see a big screen right there, big live screen. Can do whatever we want to do with that screen. Um, these are messages, okay. Uh, we can make little messages uh, on the boards. Okay, you can take them up, you can take them down. So that's an office, that, that's an area we'd probably use as a reception area when we're up and rolling on our own. Um, and then lastly, you have um, workspaces that, uh, much like the classroom, workspaces allow for a live computer at a desk. Come over here, you see the live computer. I'm, I'm sitting at a desk. Uh, once again, this is a uh, active computer. Um, if I put down here, um, Let's see. Oh, got that wrong. Okay. All right. Now, again, uh, it, it's uh, it's a little slower because, again, you have to remember I'm in Zoom, uh, showing, sharing my screen with you. Okay. So I am not, uh, you know, inside there directly. So here's the advocacy network. Okay. Here is uh, our site for the Advocacy Network. Uh, we have all kinds of things here, the financial concierge approach, which is what we're doing as founding agents. You know, we're all working on the uh, financial concierge, okay? So we look at the financial concierge approach and what we're doing here. Uh, we have a video in here. And again, it's, uh, it's a little slow, but you have to recognize that we're in the world together. It's, it's instantaneous. Uh, it is not slow like this, okay? So that's uh, how we have the use of uh, computers, okay? Now, uh, if you look around, we have a big board here. Again, big board can go up and down. Um, I move it up. I move it down. Okay. If I turn around to the front, okay, up here in the front, I got the same activity, another big board, okay, I can put that board up. I can put that board down. Uh, all these little areas are, uh, are, are meeting areas. You see it right here, those are people uh, we can, that's again, this is a demo world, it's not our world, so uh, you see different names, different people, but each of those are little uh, conference areas, and each of those have three screens. If you look in that room, those are three screens, one, two, and on this wall, three. So there's three screens uh, around this little conference area for meetings, and then you can sit out here. People can sit on the couch in front of the screen, sit over here, uh, move over there. Uh, everybody can... Uh, you can take a seat up here in front of a computer. You can work with somebody one-on-one -on -one right across from you like that. So anyway, this is all the things we can do here in the, uh, uh, the, the demo world, okay? So um, let me get out of the screen share. Uh, we'll stop the share and come back live. So I wanted you to get a good feel for, uh, for that. Um, 
let me uh, just take down this and and there we go so I wanted you to get a better feel now you notice that the video itself was a little slower because it, I was in the screen share and uh, at the same time that was taking up a lot of uh, I guess uh, uh, interactivity so what I wanted to to make sure we understood coming forward is this I want you as agents to understand the power of cross-selling we are going to do numerous things together. We have the uh, referral of a lifetime. Very, very important. Uh, you should be getting that book if you haven't gotten it already. I know we've talked about this in the past, many people, but that's a must. You gotta read that book, reread it, read it again, okay? Follow the steps in that book. It's not hard, it's not difficult. It's the best way to set up a CRM, a database. It's the best way for you to build your practice and build your business. We have the uh, financial education uh, um, uh, deal with them, with FES, okay? I'm not forcing any agents. I'm not telling you you have to do it. Again, for cross-selling purposes, if you want to work in that market, that's a great way to knock on the door. We have the financial agent. Uh, uh, we have the finance agent uh, link. It's totally free. You can offer, uh, you, get paid, uh, you get paid referral fees, and you can offer um, uh, capital for business is a great way to knock on business doors, a great way to get in there and cross sell and talk about life insurance and other things, okay? Uh, we have the middle class millionaire plan which ties back to the FES, it's a, those are combined. They're all, they're all tied together, middle class millionaire plan. We got retireless, which is, again is a system on how to educate and uh, make people aware of the fact of maybe the myth of um, tax deferral and why maybe being in qualified plans is not the best option for people to do, okay? That leads to large life cases, that leads to an incredible amount of premium, and that also allows you to uh, put people in, in really much better position with tax-free income, tax advantage income, as opposed to people being stuck in qualified plans, not knowing what the government tax rate's gonna be, not knowing what the inflation rate's gonna be, and not understanding that the government can make those rules change anytime they want, okay? So that's another, uh, that's another uh, option in a vertical. Um, we, we're going to go into certain training and, and coaching that we, we do just normally, okay? So that coaching is going to include all those things. It's going to include uh, re, uh, the referral of a lifetime. It's going to include lead the field, uh, Earl Nightingale. It's going to include um, retireless, the retireless sales system. Uh, another sales system we have called prosperity selling. So all of these things are included in what you have done by committing with me to being a founding agent. I greatly appreciate that. And I'm going to do everything humanly possible to help you double, triple, quadruple, uh, even 10 times your business if possible, depending on where you're at. So all is going to start with our first, um, uh, our first mastermind meeting where we will set up our training schedules, our coaching schedules, and everything else. I'm zip filing all of the uh, white papers in the library and all of the sales concepts, uh, several, those will be separate zip files. So you'll have those, okay? Um, I am uh, unteachable. We have uh, an advocacy, uh, we have an advocacy center for, for uh, education, unteachable. So some of the things we do will be a teachable, some of it. Now, I'm also putting up Financial Transformation, which is a course I made last year. I filmed this course, which is kind of a nice foundational where you can spin off on everything as a financial concierge. Um, in uh, Financial Transformation was giving people a new outlook on um, smart decisions about money, the concepts of money. Many, some you're already aware of, some maybe you're not, but it'd be great, you know, either way. If you are aware, terrific. It just reinforces. If you're not aware, it's, it's going to add a feather uh, that you can <clears throat> use with people, okay? So I'm going to allow that uh, for you to get commissions on sales of that uh, financial transformation as well. Um, we have the uh, Enfuse tool, the video tool that you see here. Uh, we're working on live connects that, uh, that uh, you can tap into. Um, we have a few other little things that are additional, um, additional um, uh, costs to you, but nothing dramatic, but uh, you don't have to do them. But I think that some of them are very, very valuable. So you can, uh, you can put that into your portfolio of marketing and, and what you're doing. The whole concept here is this, for me to help you with all your prospecting concepts, all of your marketing concepts, all of your sales concepts, okay? 
and for me to help you get better at what you do, have all the tools in one place so you don't have to go all over the place. Look, too many agents in our industry are stuck with the uh, next thing syndrome. I like to call it the next thing. They spend 80% of their time looking for a better way to do their business as opposed to 80% of their time in their business prospecting. So that's what all coaching and training's about. I want to get you off the next thing and on to the one thing. You have to focus on the one thing. And if I can successfully do that for you, everything else I could do and put into a, into a funnel would be just bonus. If I could do one simple thing with every agent that would, would work with me and just get them focused on the one thing, it would be tremendous. So you got to get a journal. You got to do the things that focus on the one thing. And the one thing is this. We are in a relationship building business. We are in a prospecting build, building business. 80% of your time needs to be spent finding potential relationships. That's 80% of your time. 20% of your time gets spent on presenting and following up. But most people got that backwards and not even backwards. Most people not even spending, you know, 10% of their time on the front end, on the one thing that counts. And the one thing that counts is relationships. So all you are as a financial concierge, it's so simple. As a financial concierge, I help people attain financial independence. Are you interested? That's it. Would you be interested? Would it make sense? However you want to fi finalize that. I'm a financial concierge who helps people attain financial independence. And from there, the rest will be a little different. You know, the rest is, well, you know, it's different for everybody. So it's hard for me to just make a blanket statement because no two people are the same. Uh, everybody's circumstances with money and everybody's circumstances with awareness and financial literacy is at different stages. Everybody's economic conditions are different. So in order for me to best help you and guide you towards financial independence, I need to know a little bit more. That's it. You do that 80% of your time and you have more business than you know what to do with. Stop, please, please. You invested money with me, which is great. Stop looking for something else. Stop looking elsewhere. All the answers you want are right here. Together. Us together. The answers are here. All you've got to do is follow the process. Last story for you. As an old baseball coach, one thing I learned a long time ago, as a very successful pitching coach, later to be a very successful hitting coach, later to become a head coach. But here's the whole thing. I taught pitchers when we first started that it wasn't about pitching nine innings. It wasn't about winning a ball game. It was about this pitch, and it was about the process of how to maximize and deliver this pitch. And if I could do that 100 times a game successfully, the result would take care of itself. It would be a win. But I have to focus on this pitch. Same thing with a, with a hitter. I have to focus on this at bat, this pitch right now. And that's called focusing on the process and not the result. It's the same in sales. Stop focusing on, am I going to make the sale? Will I close the sale? How much will I earn when I close the sale? And focus on the process. The one step right now. The first step. That first step is, I'm a financial concierge and I help people become, uh, attain financial independence. Are you interested? I'd love to work with you. Okay, I hope this helps. Look, uh, on the 4th, uh, uh, get prepared for the mastermind. I sent you some emails. I'll send you some more. You're going to have a, a white paper here. You're going to have my email address, and certainly you got the phone for a live connect. All in the video. Lastly, we're going to talk about social media and how to set things up and why social media, and that's the mastermind group. So come prepared for that. Uh, we will also try to uh, identify the best schedule for everybody so we can get the training done. A lot of it could be done video-wise, and you don't even have to be with me live. Some of it could be live. Some of it could just be follow-up. So I put it on video. 
you guys watch it, you do it, and then you tell me, hey, Carl, I want to talk to you directly. If that's going to be easier, we still need one mastermind group a week regardless, okay? All right, folks, thanks so much. I appreciate, once again, you being a financial concierge, you being a founding member, and believe me, we are all going to do tremendously together. So let's just stay the course. Let's just keep on it every single day. And let's pay attention to the one thing. Have a great day.